the Gar Nation. Hope everybody's doing well. How's it going out there? Happy early Easter. Um, happy spring break. Looks like all you spring breakers are down here in Florida and Clearwater, where I live at, because traffic is everywhere. Can't get to the beach, can't get to work, can't get to the grocery store. But I'm not here to talk about that. I'm here to talk about this, okay? So, cool story. The tobacco shop that I live next to, Tobacco Depot, all right? I'm going to give them a shout out. It's not a paid shout out, but I'm giving them a shout out because they were running a raffle, okay? And for every cigar bought, you would get a ticket to enter the raffle, all right? So, I ended up being chosen, you know, for uh, out of, you know, everybody that entered the raffle. I won, okay? And this is what I won, all right? So this is a cigar. This is by Gurkha Sniper. All right. So this is by Gurkha. This is the Sniper right here. All right. Awesome cigar, by the way. Uh, I smoked like a bunch of these. Uh, that's how I won this in the first place. Um, so it comes in this um, humidor. So typically most um, cigars come in a cedar wood case. Um, this is an actual humidor. So the cigars come in this here, um, which is an awesome collector's item. This looks like something from Call of Duty or something. Um, so I ended up winning this and 10 cigars came with it, okay? Um, typically a case comes with 20, I believe, um, but it was nine, well, it was 10 when I won this case here. So. Also, it comes with a couple of uh, other cool trinkets, all right? So firstly, it comes with an actual hygrometer, all right? You can just take that out. It's magnetic, all right? So that's the hygrometer. Um, looks like it has the, um, can't think of what it's called, but that uh, green um, padding or whatever. You pour your water over this and the mat, the green mat, like, soaks it up. Um, I do prefer the uh, gel crystals, but it didn't come with that. All right, so um, that's the uh, hygrometer. Slide that right in there. This is all foam right here. Okay, so then it also comes with this really cool Gurkha collector's token. Get a good look at that. It says Gurkha right there. All right, so that's pretty cool. Now, even cooler than the fact that this is a humidor that your cigar is coming. Cooler than the fact that it comes with this beautiful hygrometer, or humidifier, not hygrometer, humidifier. I believe that's, whatever. Never mind my terminology, okay? I humidifier, okay, corrected. Even better than that, even better than the foam padding. It comes with this, okay? And I oversold that this, emphasis on this okay it comes with this all right <laughs> Gurkha blade all right as you can see it's authentic real deal this thing is pretty damn sharp uh, very pointy also uh, so be careful with this um, but yeah the grip is awesome um, there's not much else to really say about this but it's just fucking cool like super fucking cool um, so it comes with this. Uh, this actually comes in its own case also um, that you could wear around your neck uh, or you could wear it around your belt straps uh, if you wanted to. But I'm not Arnold Schwarzenegger. This isn't Rambo. I'm not, you know, Sylvester Stallone, Predator, none of that. So I'm just going to keep this in its safe little padding because uh, I don't want to cut myself. Um, so let you get a good look at that. All right. If you can see it. All right, and then, so let me remove this. Um, so this actually comes with quite a few layers uh, within. So I'm gonna sit this to the side. All right, so your top layer would look like so. Um, so 10 cigars would go in here, okay, 10 cigars. And it has the grooves and everything, as you can see. So I'm gonna use this to store my randoms, all right? so. My random cigars, I'll store 
on this top layer. Now remove that layer and here lies the actual Gurkha snipers. Uh, two of them are missing because um, I smoked one and this one right here is there. Um, so um, what a lot of people were telling me though is that just having a few uh, humidity packs in here um, will actually do it equal justice. Uh, don't necessarily bother with the um, humidifier. Um, you know, always having to check it and make sure, you know, it's not too moist inside of the case and everything. And I've, I've been a victim of having mold inside of my humidor as well. So I really don't want to have to, you know, bother with distilled water and all the gel crystals and everything like that. So these humidity packs, um, they said just keep two to four in here. Um, they said I could actually remove the foam if I wanted to. Um, I'll probably keep it in the foam just because it looks cool. Uh, it's more tidy. But there's under this layer, there's actually another layer um, for cigars here as well. Um, so you could actually um, put 30 cigars in this case here. Uh, one to two, two to three, I'd say two humidity packs for each layer um, of cigars, uh, pretty much. So this thing is beautiful though. All right, so awesome collector's item. If you ever come across this, I definitely consider purchasing it. Um, just for the fact, the price point on this is about $199, okay? So now consider that $199, you're getting 20 cigars, okay? And you're getting a humidifier. And you're getting a knife and that cool token that comes with it as well. $199, okay? Now that's in Clearwater, Florida at the shop that I go to. Uh, I can't say it's going to be the same price point at every shop, but that's the price they offered me. But I ended up just winning this in the raffle um, because I paid for so many cigars that I just was entered into that raffle so many times. I wanted to make sure I won it. Um, <laughs> so, you know, you got to spin to win, baby. You got to spin to win. Scared money don't make money. I know you've heard that thing. Uh, so let me... Um, Get this back in. And uh, yeah, this is the only thing is this foam is really, uh, it doesn't do too much good as far as uh, holding the knife and coin in place. Uh, but that's not, you know, that big of a deal. Um, this is kind of just for, you know, purposes of showing you guys because I probably won't uh, keep this in here. I don't want to have to pick up this big ass knife every time I want to retrieve a cigar uh, so let me get this closed up Ugh. Like, yeah this thing this one here is kind of hard to latch on for some reason but yeah handle like I said this thing looks like it's like straight out of Call of Duty I should handcuff this thing to my wrist because it looks like I'm carrying something important these are important though these are really good cigars you know, so that's that. Um, so I'm actually gonna light this baby up. Um, outside of uh, getting this really cool case of cigars, I've actually started a T-shirt line. All right. Now, if you follow me on Instagram, you're, you know, you've been in a loop of everything. Um, but I had this really awesome idea um you know i would see people uh you know with their sh cigar shirts and stuff some of them say cigar porn or like it'll say cigar junkie it'll have a a picture of a cigar um most of them are like uh like high quality transfers uh plastisol maybe vinyl or something um and they look pretty cool uh so when i had the idea of uh wanting to get into this uh business of you know making t-shirts uh designing t-shirts and building a brand um i wanted to uh, I, I tried to figure out what what would be the right demographic and um you know what community did i belong to i guess who would i tend to and you know obviously cigars uh was at the top of that list um i, I have a lot of cigar followers on uh, instagram and i follow a lot of cigar people as well and uh you know my youtube channel you know you guys are uh, a second family as well um dinner's ready 
that was, that was that's what that was. Um, so, but um, you know, so you know, I love this community, and you know, I know I don't get to communicate with you guys as often. Um, that's why I encourage you to um, follow my other social medias um, because you know, so much going on, new baby still, and work and everything like that. But um, so like I said, I've started a T-shirt line. I'm gonna put that um, website in the comments. Um, and, you know, like I said, you know, I, I don't ever tell anybody, hey, just go buy it, just go buy it. Like, if you like it, buy it. Please check it out. Um, if you like it, you know, buy something. Uh, like I said, it's going to tend to my cigar people, okay? My brothers of the leaf, my sisters of the leaf. Um, that's going to be the first thing I release is just something for my cigar people. Um, just because I love this community. I love cigars. Um I love the people that belong to the cigar community. Um, you know, we, we all have something in common. We have, you know, you know um, I'm not going to go down the list of things, um, but, you know, uh, so I say, you know, check that website out in the comments, in the description. And uh, yeah, those are cigars. As always, happy smoking, my friends. I'm going to actually, I was going to smoke this, but now I'm going to go eat dinner instead and then come back and smoke this. I might make a video about this cigar um, and just talk more about the t-shirt line, but uh, for now, like I said, happy smoking, my friends. Happy Easter, um, happy spring break, happy Monday, life is beautiful. Um, you know, whatever it is that you're chasing after, keep chasing after it, keep chasing your goals, your dreams. If you're living your dream, I'm happy for you and I'm proud of you, okay? So I'm out of here.